Sometimes this roof up over my head starts getting me down Crowding me out You know what I'm talking about I need to clear my head and head for the countryside Take a little walk Maybe take a little ride Bullfrogs croaking, smallmouth jumping Wind blowing through the trees So let's throw a cooler in the truck I know where I want to be Outdoors with Joey Mines In a deer stand back in the woods Or kicking back wet in the line Rain pours, sunshine it's all good, cause I'm doing what I love with who I like. I can find that peace of mind I'm looking for outdoors. Outdoors with Joey Mines is brought to you in part by Wendy's. Direct auto insurance. Call, click, or come by to see how much you can save. Mid-State RV Center. Coachman. You can Nuba, Grill Dome, Guy Gunner Home, Beaver Lake Grilling Planks, Highland Marina Resort, Bad Boy Buggies, and Southern Cart Services. For the next half hour, join us outdoors with Joey Mines. But it's all good, cause we're doing what we love with who we like. We can find that peace of mind we're looking happened, for. Boy? <laughs> Outdoors. Where'd it go? Hi, folks. Welcome to this week's show. Today we're on West Point Lake crappy fishing with my dearest friend in the world. I've got Dr. Daryl Durham. He's a veterinarian here in town. Uh, Doc, we fish together about once a week. That's right. <laughs> Tell them a little bit about what they can expect today. Well, we're going to be Hopefully we're going to catch some crappie on these brush piles that we've put out, Christmas trees, things like that. And uh, if they're on them, they'll usually hit it just as soon as it hits the water. And uh, you won't feel much but a little tick. But hopefully these will be big ones. Well, today it is the middle of June. A lot of you at home are probably saying, well, the crappie don't bite in the summertime. And uh, these fish are going to be in 15 to 20 foot of water. We've got the structure out, and uh, let's go fishing. I'm, I'm going to show you a little bit about how this graph works. Folks, one thing about putting out structure, uh, Doc, we've got locations that we can go straight to it without GPS, but GPS is a big part of it as well, of what we do. That's right. GPS, when you can't find it, that GPS always remembers where it is. We like lineups and different uh, different lineups on the shore so that you can go right to it but if you it's you'll be amazed how hard it is to find these brush piles sometimes you oh, think yeah. well I, I built it I can go right back to it but sometimes it with the lake fluctuation up and down it's hard to find them sometimes but the GPS of course makes it very easy to go back to them well the low ranch here's a good example right here the, this is a, a we've got the sonar and the GPS if folks if you look up where I'm pointing now we've got two icons and the reason I've got two, this, this spot is actually so big that I'm going to try and my arrow's going this way. We're going towards those icons. We're trying to get right in between them. This place is probably 10 times the size of this boat. I mean, this one is huge. We're actually about 30 feet from it right now. There's your arrow. And uh, there's a trick to actually getting on them this way. But, but GPS is, is a blessing on this hole right here. All right, all right. Look at there. Look at my there graph. It there it is, right there. Mm -hmm. See that? There's we're right on the arrow, right there. And look over here where I'm pointing. There's our fish. There's there's your trees right there. And uh, that makes it a whole lot simpler right there. But but these are basic little tips on on how to catch fish. Uh, with a little luck, there there's actually some fish there. I see your arches on it. We'll we'll set the boat up just right on it. And this brush pile, Joey, is about 10 years old. Yeah. This is an old brush pile. We, we started adding to it every year, and it's gotten bigger and bigger because it's a great brush pile. So you don't have to have a lot of brush piles. If you have three, four, five really good ones, you can go catch fish. 
Get ready for a warmer weather with an RV from Mid-State RV Center. New travel trailers starting at 9,900. And now through Wednesday, get our exclusive VIP package worth $1,500. Mid-State RV Center, the camping experts for more than 25 years. Um, is that my Wendy salad? Please, with these ingredients? <laughs> oh, look, a Wendy's cup. Yeah, mine. <laughs> Okay, that's mine too. Make no mistake, Wendy's new salads are irresistible, like the new barbecue ranch or Asian cashew chicken. Now that's better. Mid-State RV Center, satisfying customers for more than 25 years. New fifth wheel campers starting at $199 per month. And now through Wednesday, get our exclusive VIP package worth $1,500. Mid-State RV Center, Byron, Georgia. I'm JJ Hightail, ex-pro race car driver. By definition, stock cars are all the same which sounds a whole lot like car insurance. It's all the same, like rabbits, oranges, red-headed triplets. You can't tell them apart. So why pay more for the same coverage? I buy my insurance direct from Direct Auto and cut out on all the fluffy nonsense. So I'm not paying extra for the same or slightly different thing. Please, with these ingredients? <laughs> oh, look, a Wendy's cup. Yeah, mine. <laughs> okay, that's mine too. Make no mistake, Wendy's new salads are irresistible, like the new barbecue ranch or Asian cashew chicken. Now that's better. Look at there. It came out of the tree and came I caught it. Came out was. of the tree and there he was. Look at this. How about that? <laughs> How that's about a big that? Crappy okay. Too. Boy, that's a nice Oh, one. yeah. These are good fish here. That's the good thing about West Point. They do have some, look at that big old crappie. Look at him. West Point yeah. does have some big crappie. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful fish. Now that fish was halfway between here and the buoy. I know you noticed that. That's right. <laughs> I'm taking notes. I'm taking notes. Uh, That's right. I'm going to tell you folks at home the kind of lure and rod and reel today. Isn't that pretty? We're, gonna, we're keeping fish in case you're wondering. These fish are wonderful to eat. The kind of line we're using is six pound test line. And uh, if you look how bright it is, the good thing about a crappy fishing, they don't care. They don't care about the color of the line. And so we're using this so that when the fish hits, we're able to see that strike. We're able to watch that line and see the strike. We're using eight foot rods. And look at this rod right here. This is an ultra, ultra light rod. And uh, when the fish hits it, it's like using a fly rod, which is absolutely wonderful. So we're using a very small reel. You can get by with an ultralight reel. And I would spool it with the six pound line. The kind of jigs, well, it's, it's Pandora's box. You can actually, this is a 16th ounce jig head. There's your little skirt there. And today I think they like that metal flake, uh, of which has been working for them for the last couple of days. And this is real important. See this money right here? I'm going to hook him just like that. And there's your rig for today. Basic technique. Then you're going to cast it out. I'm going to show you exactly the technique. And this is important as well. Cast it out. All right. The buoy's got our, our brush marked. I'm letting it sink down. If you watch my, you see I'm doing my rod, you can watch that line jump. That's the way you work these crappy jigs right there, that little jump. That's where he's going to grab it, right there. And you'll look for that one little tap. And if you didn't, if you didn't have the yellow line, you would miss that jump. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Especially getting as old as we're getting. Yes, sir. It's hard to see it. That's right. Most crappy fishermen are, are off the lake right now. They're saying, well, the fish aren't. There's one, Doc. There it is. I saw him grab your line. <laughs> Let's bring him up. I, yep. You saw it, and I, I saw felt you. Him. I actually saw Look your at, line. Oh, Good man, boy. that's a huge crappy. Look at that Look big at that. boy. Unreal. There you go, Doc. Good boy. Oh, yes. You caught my fish. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> There's another one. Oh, I had one, too. Right. I had one, too. Let's. We'll take a good look at him. Hold him up there. Isn't that pretty? Isn't that a nice crappy? Let me see him and I'll put him in the box for right. you. I just caught him. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> uh, now that crappy, I had to really let it go to the bottom. I understand. I mean, it, it was settling almost in the bottom. 
Well, I had a, I actually had you one. You had right, the same when you had. I it. had one right behind you. The that's the. Okay, we've got these fish located, and and maybe with them biting a little tough today, we can show you folks at home a little better technique. Because you've really got to pay attention to your line when it jumps. I, I think our fish are to the right of that. Mm -hmm. we're, we're gonna see. I had one hit it the same time. Same time. Yep. Yep. Okay. Let's try another one, Doc. That will be all over them. All right, we've got them located now. Here we go, folks. Here we go, Doc. Yes, sir. Now we're catching them. Another good one. Look at that. Oh, yes. Great. These are nice fish. Very Man, nice. I'm going to get us over this way. This is the biggest crappie I've seen on this pile yet. Yeah, yeah. These have been good ones. A lot ones. of times these would have been in the past. They've not been huge, but these are huge. Isn't that beautiful? Mm-hmm. That's what it's all about right there. Now in the upcoming months, we're going to start doing cooking segments on the show. And uh, they're going to be brought to you by KitchenAid. We've got our, our greenhouse that we've been working on. And, and folks, we're going to take a couple of minutes and flash back to the greenhouse and show you some of these new green products that are going into the home that I've always dreamed of. Y'all stay with us. Folks, I've got Jonna Barrett. She's the designer and architect right. as well as Sustain House. These are wonderful companies. Uh, tell the folks about them. Okay. Well, Barrett Design is our architecture firm uh, based out of Atlanta. And uh, Sustain House is the single family residential division of Barrett Design. Um, we created Sustain House really to focus on sustainable construction and okay. energy efficient design. You know, there, there's a lot of talk about energy efficiency, and that's really a new standard in, in buildings. But what we wanted to do is take it to the next level so that you know that all of the products that are going into the house come from renewable sources, sustainable forestry practices. It's a whole picture. Well, this house that we're building, needless to say, is a greenhouse, and it's <laughs> got a lot of new concepts, ideas. Uh, energy saving, water saving, insulation. Yes. There's yes. there's a lot to this house. There is a lot to this house. Um, we have very carefully selected all the manufacturers and all the products to make sure that everything that's going in this house is really, um, it's very cutting edge. Anybody that's interested in learning more about what's going on here, please go to joeysgreenhouse.com. If you want to learn more about your company, it's sustainhouse.com. That's right. Y'all stay with us. Folks, it's time to go fishing on West Point Lake in LaGrange, Georgia. This is my 30th year of guiding on West Point for stripers and crappie. Striper fishing is outstanding on West Point. A typical day consists of stripers in the 5 to 15 pound class. Crappie fishing is my favorite trip I take on West Point. Over the years, I have put over 75 brush piles on the lake that concentrate the crappie in large numbers. New for 2013, I am running two guide boats. I have a 22-foot center console and a 22-foot pontoon with bass seats that is capable of fishing up to six people. The pontoon is handicap accessible. Like me on Facebook to have a chance to win a two-day fishing trip with me on West Point. To book a trip, call 706-402. 3607 or visit me on the web at joeyminds.com. Hi folks, I'm Lee Pickard at Bitt State RV Center in Byron, Georgia, Georgia's largest volume dealer and your RV dealer. I want to talk to you a little bit today about what Mitch State RV Center has to offer. We have products from the $99.95 travel trailer to the $85 to $100,000 aviator new product that you'll see Joey using throughout his show. Uh, Motorhomes, 37 feet, bath and a half. Folks, if you need an RV or RV service or body shop or paint, uh, we have it at Mid State RV Center. We have over 57,000 square feet of service and parts facilities and then another 17,000 square feet of sales facilities all located here on 56 acres in Byron, Georgia. You can come to our website, midstaterv.com. We tried to make it easy for you to communicate with us. You can call us on our toll-free number, 1-800-226-3654. Uh, folks, we want to be your RV dealer. Boy, that sun's getting bright. I think I'm going to put my, my big hat on today, Doc. 
Joey, this is a situation like we talked about before. The fish are not just eating it real rapidly. They're, they're, you're having to make them bite. Yep. And I think this is where tipping the jig with that venom is very important. We wouldn't get a bite if we didn't do that. There's another one. Yep. Uh, there's no question in my mind, if we were just throwing a jig, we would not catch, uh, catch the fish. That's right. There's no doubt. I mean, we've been, I've actually been out here, um, I'm, I'm fortunate enough that I fish, <laughs> fish about 200 days a year. <laughs> and so I, uh, I try it with just the jigs. And there's days that they will hit the jig. Mm -hmm. There's days. Today ain't that day. They want it to be tipped. They want it to be alive. Um, there's days when, when you can throw a dead mana out there and we've got some in the, it ain't that day. We've got, I'm gonna show you right here, this mana is gonna be wiggling when I let him go. There he is right there. I think you've got to actually even have that today to catch a fish. I think it's that important. They're, they're just barely, barely hitting it. I'm gonna make another cast, we're right by the buoy now, and uh, we found some more fish right there beside it. <laughs> there we go. Well, I'm surprised it's not the same fish because we weren't six inches apart. That's right. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, mine got off. Okay. All right. All right. Well, there's wow. another. I mean, we are literally throwing on top of each other. I think you believe that part about if you can find them in one tree, there's about to be 50 of them in that one tree. Without a doubt. I don't have to convince you, do I? Nope. That's right. <laughs> Oh, what a beautiful morning on West Point Lake. Now you laid out of work today, didn't you? I mean, I I'm gonna go ahead and I wanna go ahead and let the world know that you cut work. That's right. <laughs> I definitely laid out. Is there somebody today. I need to call or, or <laughs> no, you look kind of puny? You don't I, need to tell anybody. I'm uh, just fine. They don't need to know where I am. I didn't know <laughs> if you look you were called in sick or you Right. I didn't know what your problem was today. That's right. Yep. Yeah, you got that part figured out. Okay. He's on there, Doc. Get him, Doc. I'll just change if you were awake. <laughs> you me, swimming off with it? Let me, was I, I sleeping? I was watching your line <laughs> run to the left. You I wondered when I was going to do something, didn't you? I was letting him eat it. You ain't yeah. got any reaction pills I can give you, do you? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Now he's done, Doc's done slipped up and put a new lure on. Yeah. And uh, we'll show the folks at home that with the little blade. Mm-hmm. A little bit more flash. I okay. want to tell you about that. You saw that. <laughs> well, I appreciate you. That's right. I appreciate you keeping me informed Keep on what it is. Keep me informed if it. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was right there, though. All right. Uh, I'm going to stay with what I got. There you go. I'll I'm not it. big in the change. If you bite it, I'll sell you one for today's <laughs> yeah. over. They, they just went up, though. They're pretty high. Yeah, they're not on sale. They're right? not on no. sale today. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We got more of where they came from. <laughs> this is a nice fish, I think. There you go. Catchy. Oh, yeah. God, look at what pretty look, look how pretty that is. Good Lord, not. How'd I let you catch Land that, that fish? fish for me there, How'd though. I let you catch that fish? That's right. How about that? <laughs> oh yes, that's a that's a nice one. Woo! That's a slab, isn't it? Wow. Beautiful. Beautiful. I don't know how in the world he got past mine to get to you. I can't imagine. Look at that. <laughs> Look how thick he is. I'll be filleting this fish, and and it'll be nothing but huge fillets when we get through, and. Uh, there's actually one way to cook them, is fry them. <laughs> There's no need to sugarcoat it. That's we, it. we fry them, and uh, we'll definitely be frying them come, come this evening. Golly, whoo, that's a big one. They might like that little they spinner. They might like it, we'll yeah. see. I just thought we'd try okay. it. Okay. We'll see what happens. Pretty fish, Doc. But I never felt him hit it. He just kind of swam off with it. Yeah, they that. might want that. You got that, that little little spinner on there. Yeah, got a little bit more flash. I don't know. There he is. You got another one? Yes, sir. <laughs> another spinner or another fish? <laughs> I ain't got no more spinners. 
<laughs> I appreciate yeah. it. I, appreciate I don't have but a box one. Album I got. There. I had one. All right. I had one in mine. Yeah, you just keep on. That's keep all right. On, huh? Don't worry about me. I'll see you at the way. Uh oh. I'll see you at the way. There you go. Yeah. I'll pick him up for you. Did you need? You need anything to drink? You need some crackers or chips or anything? Just throw the fish on the floor. That's it ain't, right. It ain't no problem. <laughs> it just. Right. It, ain't, it ain't a problem. <laughs> That's right. Scratch them back in a minute. Yeah. I just had. There you go. I just had a good hit. Did you? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the way they're hitting it a little harder now. They are. All right. I'm just gonna keep us in the same little spot. Man, they are hitting that spinner. That's that's got my attention. Where do you even get those? I ain't never. I mean, I don't have any. Oh. Uh. I can't tell you that. <laughs> They're not, but in every thousand of stores. I promise you. But it does work. Come here, Joey. Dang, gummy. Yes, sir. You get them from me today. <laughs> That's oh, right. God, uh, people ain't going to appreciate you whipping up on me. I'm going to go ahead and tell you. Yeah, I noticed that. When I, when I start whipping you, we start moving. <laughs> That's right. I'll have the buck. The I'll boat the, will start turning in circles. I'll have the boat up there in them trees here in a minute. That's we'll right. take care of that little problem. Another pretty fish. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all these fish in the live well. Whoo! Now you tell me that ain't a good little mess. Golly. At Mid-State RV Center, we have more than 25 years of experience satisfying our customers. We have built one of the most comprehensive service facilities in the state of Georgia with fully trained and master certified RV technicians to tackle those tough RV problems. We repair and paint almost anything. Come to Georgia's largest RV dealer. With more than 250 RVs in stock every day, Mid-State RV Center, Byron, Georgia, the camping experts. I'm JJ Hightail, ex-pro race car driver. As a celebrity, I'm used to having things my way. Only red, color speed. Everything designed for me. Deep fried chair. You can eat it. That's why I'm insured by Direct Auto. They let me pay where, when, and how I want. By phone, internet, or at the store. You could say, they kiss my car seat. Folks, it's time to go fishing on West Point Lake in LaGrange, Georgia. This is my 30th year of guiding on West Point for stripers and crappie. Striper fishing is outstanding on West Point. A typical day consists of stripers in the 5 to 15 pound class. Crappy fishing is my favorite trip I take on West Point. Over the years, I have put over 75 brush piles on the lake that concentrate the crappy in large numbers. New for 2013, I am running two guide boats. I have a 22-foot center console and a 22-foot pontoon with bass seats that is capable of fishing up to six people. The pontoon is handicap accessible. Like me on Facebook to have a chance to win a two-day fishing trip with me on West Point. To book a trip, call 706-402-3607 or visit me on the web at joeyminds.com. The following segment is brought to you by Direct Auto Insurance. Call, click, or come by to see how much you can save. Huge clinic here in uh, LaGrange, Georgia. Tell the folks a little bit about it. Well, I've been in LaGrange probably about 25 years, and my business has grown, and I wanted to expand. Uh, I was a solo practitioner, but I was in a small building with a small parking lot. I just couldn't get any, I couldn't grow. Sure. So I had to look for a new spot and I went ahead and got a real good spot on the parkway and went ahead and built the, the veterinary hospital of my dreams that I've dreamed about for years <laughs> and years. And it's, I have two other associates with me now. This veterinary hospital is big enough where we could grow to five or six veterinarians if, if, we, if LaGrange continues to grow. It's absolutely gorgeous. Anybody that wants to come by and visit you. Sure. Um, you know, you've got the capabilities of doing surgery on dogs that, that a lot of universities do. And I, I think y'all can handle a lot of that now. We do, we do most everything. Uh, we try to, we, we're not specialists, but we do a lot of things because we like to do it. We enjoy what we do. Mm -hmm. We went to school to learn how to do it. And so we 
not afraid to tackle a lot of tough problems. We like doing that. I understand. And we offer somebody, if they, if they can't afford to go to the university, which is going to be more expensive, then, then we try to offer a lot of services. And we offer a tremendous amount of services, surgical type surgeries and diagnostic surgeries with ultrasound uh, that not everybody offers, but we like to do that and we enjoy doing it, so. You know, the ultrasound, I was there the other day and, and Dr. Kirby showed me how that ultrasound works. You can find out a lot about your dog by running that little machine Ooh, over him. Amazing, amazing. You know, when I went through school, we didn't have ultrasound. Didn't sure. have it at the university. There's one but boy. Now, There's a fish. Okay. It's it's very common, and it's amazing what you can find with that ultrasound. We use it every day. Well, that's the same one that you know the, when the ladies are pregnant, I guess. Per, oh, I had him. He same got away. type of yep. ultrasound. Okay. Well, you've got a wonderful place, and anybody that that wants a absolutely wonderful vet, and you know somebody that'll take care of your dog your cat that really cares about the animals, there, there's no question uh, my buddy Dr. Durham will, will take care of all of those needs for you. Folks, it's time to go fishing on West Point Lake in LaGrange, Georgia. This is my 30th year of guiding on West Point for stripers and crappy. Striper fishing is outstanding on West Point. A typical day consists of stripers in the 5 to 15 pound class. Crappy fishing is my favorite trip I take on West Point. Over the years, I have put over 75 brush piles on the lake that concentrate the crappy in large numbers. New for 2013, I am running two guide boats. I have a 22-foot center console and a 22-foot pontoon with bass seats that is capable of fishing up to six people. The pontoon is handicap accessible. Like me on Facebook to have a chance to win a two-day fishing trip with me on West Point. To book a trip, call 706-402-3607 or visit me on the web at joeyminds.com. Looking for a great location for a romantic getaway, a family vacation, a reunion, or a fishing party with your buddies? Come to Highland Marina Resort. We have waterfront cabins to fit every budget. Check out our newly constructed Lake Point Chalets. The lake views are awesome and the sunsets are breathtaking. There's a waterfront restaurant and a fleet of rental craft. And the fishing, it's awesome. For all the details, visit our website at highlandmarinaresort.com. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's show. Dr. Durham, it has been an absolute pleasure doing a show with you today. I've enjoyed it once again. A lot of fun. Well, I know that we do a lot of crappy fishing, and years ago we did the bass and the stripers. There's no question, what's your favorite fish on this lake? Oh, I love the crappy fish, definitely. Well, anybody that's interested in a trip like this, I actually guide some for it. We, uh, we catch lots of fish on a trip like this, and the good thing, you're able to take them home and enjoy them and uh, eat them for supper that night. So, uh, wonderful time of year. It is mid-June. These fish will bite all the way through. We'll catch these in July and August as well. So anybody that's interested in a trip, please give me a call. If you've got a dog that you need a little help with, don't forget Dr. Durham, the LaGrange Veterinary Hospital. Wonderful people and is obvious a wonderful friend of mine. Folks, for Dr. Daryl Durham, I'm Joey Mines. Y'all have some good hunting and good fishing. I'll see you next week.